Hi, I'm your West Librarian, Mrs. Broman Bender, and this is all you need to know about the Illinois State Library's Read for a Lifetime Reading Program and all of the books on the list, each in 30 seconds or less. When in school, you can find all the books on this shelf. You only have to read four books to receive most of the prizes listed here, but there are more rewards and you're honored by the Board of Education if you read all four books all four years or all 24, five books on the list. You'll receive this bookmark from your teacher, the library, or when you pick up your books, and it shows you how to register and report your books. And use the form provided by your teacher to request books from the library. There are two reporting forms that will soon be available on our website, and you can use the QR codes here as well. So let's start with Born a Crime by Trevor Noah. Trevor should never have existed. He was born to a white father and black mother in South Africa, which was illegal at the time, and could have resulted in five years in prison or Trevor being taken away. He was hidden and had terrible experiences before apartheid ended. This is his story. Call of the Wild. This is the shortest and oldest book on the list. Buck is an Alaskan sled dog stolen from his home and sold to help with mail delivery and the Klondike Gold Rush, where he eventually shows his strength and will to survive and help others. Great movie, too. Kirke is a story from Greek mythology and a retelling of the Odyssey. She's the daughter of the sun Titan Helios, but is banished by Zeus when her powers of witchcraft are discovered. The Cruel Prince begins with two murders by a vicious fairy warmonger who then brings their mortal daughters back to the world of goblins and demons and fairies. One of the girls is tired of not being accepted in this world and tries to prove them wrong and seek revenge. A Curse So Dark and Lovely is a retelling of Beauty and the Beast set in a parallel world. Five teenagers are involved in a family of secrets. Their stories may not seem to fit until the pieces come together in the end. Racism, abuse, and other heavy issues can be found in DIG. An evil assistant principal, ridiculous school rules, and exclusive clubs. You won't find that at Lincoln Way, but you will and don't get caught where a boy is framed for a, fr a prank pulled off by the Chaos Club, and now he wants payback. A field guide to the North American teenager is narrated by a black French Canadian who relocated to Texas, where he's an outsider judging people by their stereotypes, only to find out he might be wrong about them. The Fountains of Silence is historical fiction that takes place in 1957 Madrid, led by a dictator. A young photographer comes to visit with his parents and meets Anna and starts to explore what is really going on in this silenced nation. The Haunted is one of the shortest, creepiest, and scariest books on the list. A family tries to escape their past, but ends up moving into a haunted house. Mickey injures herself before her softball season and takes prescription drugs for her pain. Of course she can stop at any time. She would never crush and snort the pills until she does. And she would never mix them with water and shoot them in her veins until she does. And she would never try heroin in the book Heroin. Hillbilly Elegy is a true story of a self-proclaimed hillbilly living in a dysfunctional and violent family in Appalachia. The fastest book to read on this list is I Was Their American Dream because it's a graphic novel. It involves a family story of immigrating to America in search for a better life. Internment is set in the future when Muslim Americans are sent to internment camps by a new president. It focuses on Layla, who seeks contact with her boyfriend to help her gain freedom for herself and others. Rico might have hit the jackpot by selling a winning lottery ticket at the gas station where she works, only the winner has not come forward and may not even know he or she won. So Rico and her rich classmate set out to find the lottery ticket holder, but of course, there's a surprise in the end. Just Mercy is the true story of a lawyer who fights for justice for those too young for or unfairly given the death penalty or those who are innocent yet imprisoned. Little Women is a classic about sisters and their mother trying to survive on their own during the Civil War with love and imagination. This is another shorter book and a quick read. When you leave school, you all head in different directions to your homes. And in the book, uh, Look Both Ways, we meet 10 kids with different stories headed in their own directions. 
When Monday doesn't show up for the first day of school, her best friend Claudia is worried and the only one who seems to notice she's missing. Jay plans to spend the last semester of his senior year playing video games until his cousin is murdered and he instead travels to the Philippines for the real story. Pet is another short book. It's about a black trans girl who lives in a city that protects her with no monsters of society. But when you think you've been without monsters for so long, you sometimes forget what they look like. This is a unique story that is not always what it appears to be. Stevie Bell is going to start her first year at Ellingham Academy, founded many years ago by an ambitious tycoon whose wife and daughters were kidnapped soon after the school opened. There was a clue left with a riddle that has yet to be solved, and Stevie plans to solve it, even if the kidnapper may have returned. Two girls go live with their grandmother in a town where their aunt disappeared when she was younger. Five years ago, a girl was found murdered in a local amusement park. Now someone is threatening to repeat the murders on homecoming night. Students are in quarantine at the Baxter School for Girls. After an illness, they call the tox hit and teachers start dying and the students were infected. All right, let's not talk about this one. But if you're interested, that one is Wilder Girls. The last one. During high school, Imani has a baby, which causes her to have to make decisions and changes revolving around her new life and love of food and cooking. And you can request and check out any of these books from the library. Most of them are also in our ebook collection. So to find that, you can go to the Lincoln Way website, select West or your school, and then Academics. Then go to Media Center and West Online Catalog then to Destiny um, Discover. From there, you can select your book and check it out with your ID number and password. We have other ebook programs too, so you can check out the QR code or information that is soon to come on our website or the handouts or on social media, or you can ask your teacher or librarian. So here is also where you will be able to find these in the future on resources on our website. And you should also follow us on Instagram at LWS Library to get updates, online resources, new books, and pictures and videos of what is happening in the library with our students. Well, I can't wait to meet you all and see you soon at West.